Hey everyone, Andreas here with another homebrew or homemade beer Wednesday update. Apologize for being late, but I'm busy as usual. I've got a few updates this week. Uh, the first one is just some short video of my hops that I'm growing. Um, so let's check those out. Alright, so here is my Cascade hops. Um, not very big right now, but um, they're growing pretty quickly. Uh, I'm pretty pretty thankful for that. Um, fortunately though, you've got this plant here um, growing all well, but then over here I've got my golding hops. Um, I'm playing some encouraging music for them um, to hopefully get them to grow, but as you can see, they haven't even really broken the ground, so um, I don't know what that's about. Um, and then my fuggles as well, they uh, are not grown either, so I don't know if I watered them too much or didn't water them enough, I'm not really sure. Um, but I don't know, I hear they're pretty hardy, so I haven't lost hope yet. It's just strange that the other hops are like two inches. Um, and then these two, as you can see, they uh, haven't really hit the broken through yet, so we'll see about those. So yeah, as you can see, uh, the Cascade hops are quite a bit taller than the rest of them. Um, I don't really know what that's about, but when I pulled them out of the packaging when I first got them, the Cascade already had shoots growing up um, in the bag, so maybe it's just ahead of the other ones. Um, I'm not sure, but I'll keep watering them and see what happens. Um, and also, this past, on a Tuesday, I think it was, we got around five or six inches of snow, um, which completely covered those hops, um, but they seem to rebound pretty well, um, so I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, but as you can see, it's completely melted and it's a pretty nice day. It's kind of cloudy. I think we might get rain or snow, um, but it's otherwise a pretty good day. Uh, the other update that I have is actually related to hops. Um, if any of you guys are in Colorado and on Facebook, um, the logger Colorado Native, I know it's a Coors company which kind of stinks, but um, on their Facebook page they are doing a volunteer hop grower. Um, it's not a contest, but it's, a, it's an event, if you will, where you sign up and they will actually mail you a couple rhizomes to grow and then later in the fall um, they'll announce these hop drop um, dates where you'll harvest the hops and submit them, or not submit them, but you know, ship them or give them to um, these locations and they'll actually brew with them for the Colorado native beer, you know. So it's, for those that you don't, for those of you that don't know, um, it's just a, a beer. I'm pretty sure that they source most, if not all, of the ingredients from Colorado. Um, it's a lager. It's all right. It's it's definitely more interesting than a regular Coors, but it's not homebrew. Um, but it's a, it's kind of an interesting initiative to kind of bring together, uh, you know, hop growers from around Colorado. So like I said, if you're in Colorado and you have an interest and I mean, I look at it, even if I don't necessarily support everything that Coors does, um, they're shipping me free a couple rhizomes. I don't I think it's Willamette um, hops. I'm not totally sure yet. Um, but they are going to start shipping those on the 10th of April. So um, that's like five days from now. Um, so, yeah, if you, even if you don't support them, you know, they're giving you free hops, um, which grow back every year. So uh, I see it as kind of a win-win. And also I'm kind of giving to, to that lager. Um, even though if I won't necessarily drink it, I can tell my friends that some of my hops, even if it was, you know, one one millionth, of what they needed or whatever, um, you know, a part of it was in that logger that shipped around Colorado. So I will link to that in the description of this video if you guys want to check it out. Um, sorry, there's a fox running by back there. Um, anyway, uh, yeah, I'll link to that in the description if you guys want to check that out. Um, thanks for watching. I will guess I'll see you guys next week. Thanks for subscribing. See ya. Cheers. Just got done filming 
we're shooting this homebrew Wednesday update and as I was wrapping up uh, these bunch of deers just came down uh, you can see there's a few down there um, and a few more over there so um, yeah pretty pretty wild just up here taping and they decide to show up and eat my grass as long as they stay away from my hops I'm all right 